Volcano Girl is out now on mobile devices, and it's actually the game Volcano Princess, just named differently on mobile, for reasons I don't know. But yes, Volcano Princess has just released on mobile devices, and while I tried to enjoy this game on mobile, I just couldn't. What is up my dwellers of the interwebs, I'm Sorosin, and this is my first impression on the mobile port of Volcano Princess called Volcano Girl on the Play Store. You begin the game by finding out your wife has passed and you're looking after your daughter on your own and you have been already for the last five years. The game begins on her sixth year and you can name her, give her a birthday, and even choose her blood type. You can also do the same for yourself as well. You will spend your days giving your daughter lessons, interacting with her, and going to events and places of interest. All of these things can raise your daughter's stats in various ways. It's up to you to teach her and raise her in the way you want. You can even put in talent point skills in a skill tree for when she gets older, too. In this game, you're tasked with raising your daughter. That's what this game is all about. You can give her lessons of various kinds, and you can only do five lessons per day. I found mixing in some playtime with dad helps to revitalize her and help to increase her chances of doing well in the next class. There's also playtime where you can play hide or seek or other games too. And you can also converse with her once a day as well in the bedroom. There will also be events that appear during the year that you can go to and play mini games with your daughter there. It's all very cute. While the game does have some minor voice acting, it's not a lot. So most of the time you will be reading. The rest of the audio in the game seemed fine. The music was nice and I didn't hear any poor audio either. I really liked the art style for this game. It was very cute. Everything was 2D anime art style and it was very nice. Overall, I'd say that Volcano Princess on mobile is a huge disappointment. First of all, it was confusing that they gave the game a different name with Volcano Girl and then the constant delayed responses in the game, wrong control prompts by telling us to use a mouse and the crashes and getting stuck on loading screens or cinematics just not playing. It basically made the game unplayable, which was a shame because when I was able able to get it to work, the game was really cute and seemed fun. At this point, I just want to buy the game on Steam since it looked like a really nice game and has overwhelmingly positive reviews on the Steam page. I have to unfortunately give this mobile port of this game a 3 out of 10 overall score. It's just not worth your time. Play the game on a different platform for now until they fix their mobile game. So there you have it, that's my first impression on the mobile port of the game Volcano Princess. Thank you for watching, I'm Sorosin, have a fantastic day. Please drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed my content and hit that bell icon to stay up to date on all my upcoming videos. And if you're watching this on TapTap.io or on the TapTap app, I hope you'll consider following my profile as well. Bye bye!